Good evening, I'm Kylan Mills. Thanks so much for staying up late with us tonight on LEX 18 News After the Game. The woman behind the story of Triple Crown winner Secretariat died this weekend. Helen Penny Chenry played a big role in expanding the sport of horse racing, and her friends credit her for inspiring women in particular. Carolina Buchek has more on Chenry's legacy in tonight's LEX 18 Big Story at 11. They're just horse fans. They just want a little recognition. Recognition is what she gave them, and the fans returned the favor. Just going like this was instinctive. Helen Penny Chenery waved her hands like this often as she found great success in thoroughbred racing. Her friends and fans called her the first lady of the sport, and this weekend is a somber one for friends who say the world lost a legend. It's a sad day for everyone who knew her, and especially those within the racing industry. At 95 years old, Chenery died in her Colorado home on Saturday, but her friend and longtime business partner, Leonard Lusky, says she leaves behind a legacy, a reputation of breaking down barriers and gender stereotypes. The horse racing industry was traditionally very much male dominated, and here she is, uh, you know, a housewife from Colorado, and, and turning it on her, on the sports year. It, it was an amazing time. Chenery became well known alongside Secretariat, the horse who stole American hearts while winning the Triple Crown. But the pair did more than just win. They inspired Americans during a tough time in history. And friends say Chenery specifically inspired women to take part in business and in sports. She never really looked at herself as a feminist, but I think she she was one in so many different ways. and. She certainly broke a lot of barriers. Breaking down barriers and inspiring hearts. Covering the news, Carolina Buchek, LEX 18 News.